What's going on out there guys? You already know man. It's your boy the original game head bringing you back some more Red Dead Redemption 2. All right guys, so it's been a while since I uploaded this um but I'm going to finish this out ASAP. So in the course of the next coming days, this thing will be done and uh put to rest, okay? Because I think I dragged it on long enough and I am going to just finish it all out for you guys. So let's get this thing started. So apparently the horse can't come too close to the camp. <laughs> same old same. Let's get it in. Working hard? It's the lumbago. I have I overdo it. I, I'll get a relapse. It's very serious. Get up or get out. Oh, you can be so testy. What is it? Constipation? Guess you're my proof I'll never quite outrun my sins. You got so sanctimonious in your old age. No wonder she left you. It's like rooming with the King James Bible. <laughs> Get up! Ow! I, I, I'm getting up. Oh, no, what, what did I have to tell you? I, I went into town. And, oh, I got, I got a little drunk. And, oh, shit! Well, we gotta go. We gotta go to San Denis. Charles. Charles Smith is alive, I reckon. Charles Smith alive? Really? I, I reckon. This I dreamed it all, and by the sound of it, not doing too good neither. Get off. All right. Yeah. <sighs> Back in San Denis. I never liked this place. Oh, yeah. Well, me neither. All, All right. right. So we're back in San Denis. A lot of bad stuff went down here. Sure. I can't wait to get Micah. I'll take the saloons. You take the saloon. Now, how about I take the saloons? And you take the slums. I cannot wait to get Micah, man. I am gonna fill him full of lead when I see him. It's crazy that we had to we, we took a nice little train. You know? Cause at first uh we didn't you know, uh I don't think it was a way to take a train to anywhere. It just randomly goes and stops uh, you know. So not really randomly stops and goes. It's always train stations, but just to bring us straight to San Denis, I don't know if there's actually one that does that, but let's see if we can't go in here real quick. Okay. Let's just, oh, wow. Let's just see if I can, um, let me just grab my stuff. You know how you know I am, guys. I just gotta grab the bare necessities, the bare essentials. Oops. All right. I can't take it with me. Seriously? Okay, I can. And then. I'll be taking this with me also. Because you never know what we're going to encounter. So, let's make it happen. I really don't want to knock anybody over, but I need to get around. Excuse me. Oops. Didn't want to knock her. <laughs> you more than touched her. My goodness. You knocked her damn near knocked her over. All right, let's get up in here. Bonjour. How can I help you today, sir? Listen, you seen a big Indian fella? Huh. Indian? Yeah, a boxer. No. Nope. Sorry, mister. No. Nope. Actually, yes. He, I think he's fighting, I believe. Fighting out behind Saint Saturnine. Thank you. Thanks a lot. No okay. problem. 
We should see if we have anything to actually sell. Let's see, do we have anything to sell that we can sell them? Oh, we have lots of things actually. I think they might be starting soon. Let's sell it all. Sell all of that. Yeah, we had a lot of stuff that we could sell. Nice. Lots Enjoy of goodies. Fight. Lots of little goodies we could sell. What is this? I really don't care for it. It's going. What else can we sell? Yeah. I would head along that way. What is, this? what is that actually? Gold nuggets we can sell. Sell, sell, sell. All of this is getting sold. Because we don't have a need for any of it really, so. Uh no, of course not. No. Okay. We're good to go. We made a pretty penny, man. 518. That is a pretty penny we made, guys. I am not mad at that. Hey, be careful. Yeah, whatever. Yep. Get out my way. <laughs> oh my gosh, come I was and I was trying to get on my horse. Unbelievable. And I was trying to get on my horse and look at look at what happened. Unbelievable. <laughs> I tackled him to the ground and I was just trying to get on my horse. Just started in Saint Denise and, and here come the drama. Oh, good lord. I was just beginning to enjoy some peace and quiet. Okay. Why is it that I always have to retake my guns, like, all the time? Uh, come on. Always gotta retake my guns, like, come on, can I not just keep them? Always seem to have to retake them. Hey. Folks, they love a surprise, but they hate a massacre. We both know and what you, you are a do. killer. I'm leaving now. He don't know the half of it. John, you're, you're. I'm alive. <laughs> so are you. <sighs> So's he. That's Uncle. What are you doing? I don't know. I'm alive. Uncle thought maybe he was in some sort of trouble. Uh, kind of, just... I don't know. I, I'm throwing fights for a few dollars. Throwing fights? Sure. And you like that? Of course not. So... So... Let me go place a bet. Come on. Man, I thought you were dead. Sure. Abigail's still alive too, only... She left me. Uh, excuse me. I'd like to place a bet. On who? On myself, to win. Lone Wolf. How much? All of this. Okay. Funny thing, I pegged you for the favorite, but the odds just got real good. What about you, sir? A uh, little wager on the wolf here? Real redskin brave. Ladies sure, I'm a fan of the wolf. Give me a bet on him. Have I got a treat for you? An epic battle between the descendants okay, so of I had to bet on him. and a not so noble savage. On my left, a ferocious battler from the valleys, Simon of Wales. And on my right, an engine Hercules. The savage, the untamable. The unbeaten and dare I say unbeatable lone wolf. You know how this works. No weapons, no forfeiting, no crying like a beast. Let's see what happens. Everything else goes. You win by knockout, you win by retirement, or you win by death. Let's have a good fight, boys. Let's keep it clean, but not so clean. Come on. Come on, Charles. 
There we go. There we go. Get him, Charles. Sova. There we go. There we go. Nice. Sova. Come on, Lone Wolf. Better get you the hell out of here. Hey, Lone Wolf. Whoa. How? Made my months, but you also made some fellas mighty unhappy. So it goes. Here's your share, partner. Nice. We just made the bed. I said we. So you keen on staying around here, or heading off with me and Uncle? But John, I haven't seen you two in years. I know. But right now, my sense is you just need to lie low. Where? We got a little place up past Blackwater, in the high country. Okay. I gotta grab my baggage. I booked a steamer heading up river. That's why I was pretending to throw the fight. Okay, boys. I'll meet you at the bridge outside Saint Denis. What are you doing? Oh, just have a few urns to run. <laughs> You're useless. I. I'm a deep thinker. Be quick. Come on. All right. This way. Made a nice little 40 bucks. My bag's on the dock side. So, wasn't bad. What happened? You mean back then? Uh, Arthur helped me get out. Gave me a chance to live, I guess. You you know that Arthur Sure. Word got to me up north, so I went back and buried him in Miss Grimshaw. I had to run. If any of us had been found, we'd have... Oh, of course. I understand. He's where he would have wanted to be. A pretty hillside, facing the evening sun. He gave me a satchel with some of his things in it. Remember that journal he always drew in? I got it. I'm a bit of a draftsman myself nowadays. Well... He wasn't a good man. None of us were. But, uh, maybe he was true to himself. Him and his code. <laughs> that pig-headed bastard. You get sick <laughs> like that, I guess you... You gotta cling to something. Hey, he was hoping to come out of it. Hope was about all he had left. That's said. Maybe all any of us have. Hmm. Anyway, I heard all you were dead. Or I might have come looking. And me, the same about you. Dutch? Who knows? Dead? Maybe? I'm not sure. I heard all kind of things, but... One thing I know... He ain't around here. I ain't heard nothing real in years since... Well... That time. Nor me. Micah? I hope that bastard's dead. You know, he was the one speaking to them agents. What? Putting them on us the whole time. Or since before I got off Sisica. They picked up Strauss. The agents. Made a real mess of him. I heard he died in custody. Never said a word. Damn. I guess some folk is strong in ways you can't see. Here, well. We gotta do what we gotta do. Uh, hold on. What? Careful. Why? Those are Guido Martelli's men. Who? He, uh, he used to work for Angelo Bronte. I've only been here an hour. Hey. Uh, Come over here. What now? Well, you go left, I go right. On three. Mm -hmm. Three. Here we go. Back to business. Back to business. Let's. Yeah. There we go. Back to business, as usual. Okay. Nice. You do that. Definitely. Okay. Where was Uncle gonna meet us? Over the bridge going out of town. West. Hold on. Oh boy, here we go. Here we go. Back to business as usual. Not yet. Keep your eye out. Send a Remember that. Looks like they're coming around. Anyone? Good so far. Good. Outrunning them nice. 
denying it, at least. No, we can't get caught. Martelli has the police chief in his pocket. If they take us in, so we won't get out of the interview room. I don't want to oh, get a shit out over this. That's not the man I try to be anymore. No, I don't want that either. You see so, anything? Let's try to avoid it at all costs, but good. We're out. I think we're clear. Nice. If I ever want to go back, remind me that I hate Saint Denis. Guido Martelli will happily remind you of that. Give me some simple folk and wide open spaces. Speaking of simple. John Charles! <laughs> you boys been all getting up to no good? Kind of. Been getting shot at. Well, they weren't very good shots. Come on, let's head for home. <laughs> Okay guys, seems like we got part of the team back, partially. So, um, let's actually check out, um, what, what missions, okay, this is, okay, obviously, and then this is back in, uh, St. Denise. Read all about it. A copy, okay, wait. That's wrong. Okay, so we can meet Sadie in Blackwater. And then there's something else. Actually, there's something else, guys. Give me one second. There's something else that um that I just seen. But it's weird. It's like Okay, well I don't see it. It's on the map, but Oh, okay, I guess that's, I don't know, I guess that's San Denis. I thought it was something else. Ah, feels like old times. <laughs> it's good to have the old gang back together again. Let's just hope things don't turn out like last time. Here he goes. What'd I tell you, Charles? Boy is as sour as weak old milk. No wonder she didn't stay with you. Not even a retired $2 whore would stay with you. That's the goddamn truth. Now, you used to be decent company, but now you're worse than a snake with a toothache. All he does is whine, whine, whine. Excuse me. Oh, don't get all angry. It ain't gonna change nothing. You're hopeless. And I mean that literally. You got no hope. I mean, look at you. Look at this place. Your dream home. I've had better nightmares than this dream. Oh, darling Abigail, I've changed. Come live with me in an outhouse. I wouldn't ask my worst enemy to take a shit in. What are you trying to say? It's awful. It's a dump. The house has got to go. Get some self-respect, you miserable sack of shit. Build a house a lady set foot in. The place just needs a woman's touch. It needs leveling. No woman would touch this place. Now, I reckon these horses can have it down in a minute. Here, come on. Tie that end around the horses. You loop that end around there. Horses will pull it clean down. <laughs> we good? I think so. All right. Well, <laughs> let's get going. Now just pull. You got this, John? I'll go with Link. you. All okay. right, let's pull. On me. Pull. Come on. Let's go. Nice. Let's it's go. coming down. We got it. There we go. <laughs> See? I told you it wouldn't be no trouble. And now? Now we head into town, buy ourselves a house right out of a book. Same as if it were a bicycle. Where in town? There's a fella by the train store. Cakes hardwood and timber. Okay. 
You keep working here. But if I don't go with you, who's gonna Just tell you that? Just need a bit of peace and quiet from your incessant yapping. Charles, make him work. Whip him if you have to. <laughs> Whip him if you have to. That's funny. Okay. So we're going into town. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we're not. All right, so let's just go check. Um, let's just go check Sadie then. We might as well check her, cause it doesn't show anything else for us to do. So we might as well go check Sadie, and hopefully she has a lead on Micah. Because I definitely want to put a bullet in his eyes. Actually, I I really don't. I really just want to beat him down. You know what I mean? I think a bullet would just be you know way too easy for that piece of crap. Like I said, man, the way he the way he killed Arthur, man. I got you now, you piece of shit. Oh, who do you think you have, me? I Come on. Get him. Who you have, me? Me? You sure? Get him. Come on. Oh boy. There we go. There we go. There we go. Who's next? Show ass down. You want some too? Show ass down. He wasn't ready. You wasn't ready. Let's loot you. See what you got on your. S you gotta have something. Run around thinking you the man. You got some. Damn, he had a lot of stuff on him. That was a good idea. Wow, these dudes got a lot of stuff on them, yo. Poor horse. I didn't mean to, to shoot you. It's okay, man. Ugh. Poor thing. Let's see. It's another one right here. They had a. These dudes have a lot on them, man. I really didn't even realize that. Oh, snap. I slipped right down. Let's loot him. You know who I think th those dudes were? I think those were the dudes who I took the house from. The squatters. I think those, those were their peoples. But I'm glad we didn't get into any problems in St. Denis because, man... You'll be okay. I honestly just did not want to go through the whole, you know, I got to sneak back into town and that's why I try my best not to shoot um, the uh, uh, the law enforcement that was there. I try my best not to shoot them because maybe I think it, maybe if we would have gotten into a scuffle with them, then this whole area probably would have been like that pinkish color color to show that, yo, you know, you got problems there, and it's not safe to go. You know? And that would have sucked. Okay. Well, good. The horse was just jumping like crazy a minute ago. Let's see if we can't get this stuff off. It's always doing that, you know? No telling what's gonna happen with Sadie, so... You know... It's just no telling. Because Sadie is crazy. So it's no telling what would happen with her. I don't believe I've had the pleasure. Okay, where's Sadie? There she is. Hello, Sadie. Oh, John. Come sit down. Sure. You, uh, you got any work? Yeah. Well, there's always work. Whole country's getting robbed, robbing, or stopping robbers. Well, seems like there ain't much else in this world except bastards, victims of bastards, and the bastards who want to put the bastards in the ground. And which are you, exactly? Me? In my time, all three. But same as most people. I guess. Well, funny thing about this job, well, opportunity, I just might get to be all three again. How you mean? <clears throat> you ever heard of uh, Shane Finley? Cattle wrestler? T murder, thief, child killer. 
He's wanted in five states. I caught him last week. He was disguised as a lady in a house for fallen women. <laughs> I was bringing him in, and I got robbed by a professional rival of mine, James Langton. Oh, he's a nasty bastard. I didn't much like him even before he robbed me. That happened a lot. This line of work. <laughs> yeah, but they're all people like me. Anyway, now they're holed up in the desert down south, waiting to head north, so they can hand them in to the state troopers in the north country. I'd given up on the job as just a bad lot, but now that you're here, maybe we can go rob them back. Is the money good? Yeah, it's real good. Plus, I don't much like getting robbed by no one. Come on. Where is it? We're heading again, you say? Mm. South. Now come on, mount up. We got to ride. All right, let's do it. Of course we do. You know I'm always down about that money, so you know I'm always down to do it. It's on you, Sadie. Follow me. Let's ride. Of yes, course. All right. Some folk buy ranches, some buy horses. Horses are cheaper. He looks mean. He is. All My right. Ranch, it's something else, you know. You gotta come up there. He ain't had any trouble. Some squatters, but that's it for the most part. That's good. Maybe these fellers I heard about have stayed north or gone off somewhere else or dropped down dead in their own tracks. It's good country. All country is good. It's just folk that are bad. You know who I got up there with me? Uncle. Besides Uncle. Abigail? Uh, Abigail ain't come there just yet. Really? You, er, want to talk about it? Well, maybe, but Charles Smith. We found Charles Smith. Charles? He's alive? Yeah, he's doing okay. He was prize fighting in Saint Denis. Weren't seeming too well. He took everything real hard. But I think life on the plains is gonna be good for him. I always like Charles. You send him my best. I will. You know. Yeah, you Charles always been too. a stand-up dude. Build a cabin always. On the I've done that all before. Can't do it again. I'm on my own now, John. I, I ain't so good with people. Uh, the offer's there, whenever you want it. That's kind. Unlikely to be taken up, but kind. You heard anything of Dutch? Nothing. You? No. You'd think he's a colorful character. Word would get out. That's one way of putting it. Look. What happened with the gang changed everyone who was a part of it. The Dutch who put a blanket around me after the O'Driscolls, that weren't the same man at Beaver Hollow. And now, he might not be so colorful no more. You see a man whose character changed. I see a man who got found out for who he truly was. We was fools to follow him. I was a fool and I paid for it. But I was one of the lucky ones. Micah, John. Micah's the one who set it off. I blame Man, Micah that son for following of a... Dutch for too long, but I blame Micah for most everything else. You're damn right. He's out there. And someday, I hope we'll find him. But... Uh, not now. I don't understand why not now. I listen. We need to find him, and I hope we run right into him, because, man, he deserves it more than anybody else. I mean, Dutch, uh, I don't know. I think John is right. We, we just, Dutch has been found out for who he really is. He didn't change. He just, you know, I guess he strung him along. We can see over most of the country. They'll be down there. So, James Langton, the bounty hunter got this outlaw you captured in a women's boarding house? 
Shane Finley, correct. And we aim to have Langton give him back to us before he rides north with him to hand him over to some state troopers? Correct again. Though the giving back part is optimistic. I'm forever the optimist. <laughs> but it was 20 years that, uh, you know, Arthur and all of them knew Dutch and stuff, so. We cut off here. It's pretty rough, you know? I'm sure it is it's for all place. of them. It's a view, all right. Okay. Hold. Come on. Let's go take a look down in the valley. Why do I have this? Oh, man. I'm always grabbing. They're always giving me the wrong thing, you know? And this is definitely not what I want, so. Come on. I'll be taking that. Thank you. It says equip what now? Let me see. Let me equip. Maybe? Let me see. Let's see. Maybe I can equip this. Okay, let's equip the binoculars really quick. Okay, um, I think it's in items. Yep. The bounty is the feller who's all tied up. Very funny. Come on, are you kidding me? That all right. with the funny hat? That's James Langton. The other fellas just work for him. What do you think they're hidden? Uh, come on. Let's go follow them. Okay. Yeah. Because that worked out very well. Looks like I didn't know what was going on there. Us. Let's go. I had no idea what was going on right there, guys. So, goodness. Really close to the edge right now. And I really don't want to fall off. They'll be coming through here. Okay. She's really close to the side. And I am not trying to fall off at all right now. There they are. We follow and keep an eye on them. Okay. I see him. Be careful. I am not gonna get as close to the oh Stay back from the edge. Crap. Come on. You won't get north through here. What are you doing, huh? You you talking to me or like to sorry. I ain't used to having anyone with me. Yeah, I can tell. My guess is they'll stop up ahead. We can get a better look at them. You All right, come on, come well. on, whoa. Mm -hmm. If you can't outgun them, you gotta outthink them. This is just way too close to the edge, the bro. Opens up down a ways. My we'll goodness. It's like, wow, she's just not playing, man. Like, she's going way too close to that edge, and I'm not trying to follow her. Seriously. Because I'm like, nope. I, I even felt the horse like jerking. Up here, get off your horse. This might be our chance. Okay. Man. Yeah, they're stopping. And that sure is Shane Finley coming off the back of his horse. What are they waiting for? Uh, the rest of Langton's men, I think. <laughs> Langton's doing pretty well for himself. How come he's got all them men? And you work alone. <laughs> I got you. You're worth ten of them. <sighs> Great. <laughs> All right, so what you think? Should we threaten them? Start shooting at them or sneak down and pick them off one by one? I reckon sneaking down is our best opportunity, but uh, it's 
It's your call. Okay. Let's uh, sneak down. I'll follow your lead. Let's sneak down there. Mm -hmm. Let's get a okay. better look. Well, follow away. Stay down and stay close. Let's go. Plus, I think I can. I can. Do I even have a machete? Yes, I do. And this is what I want to do. That's if we get the opportunity to. I still got to. I still got to keep the machete. So you know that's a good look always. All right. Yes, we will. We will. This is fun. This is better. Instead of doing the, you know, the old regular shooting them, I'd rather, I'd rather do like this. You know, makes the game more interesting, and uh, you know, it gives it some type of depth to it, opposed to just, you know, just shooting someone. We could do that all day, but this is beautiful. We can't go around them. You take one of them. I'll take the other. All right, do what you, you gotta, gotta throw do. Throwing knife. Throwing knife. You're gonna throw a knife at this man. All right. So let's get out the throwing knives. That is the first time I, I I was able to throw a throwing knife. The first time in history that I did that. Ooh. That's crazy. Come on. Take what you got. All right, come on. Can I not move? Holy crap. Damn. Bridge is squeaky as heck. We ain't sneaking no more. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? How did that even. Dude, are you kidding me right now? How did that even happen? Like, what the hell? Oh boy. Here we go. Tried to sneak. Obviously, that didn't turn out too right. Come on. This is just, this is really unsteady, man. Unstable. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my gosh, get up. I'm trying to get across. They might kill her, yo. Sadie is crazy. Let's get a little closer. Oh, wow. She is really crazy. Wow, oh my goodness. This is crazy. Alright, we got him. We got him. was a crazy one that was a crazy one. Oh man here we go salute him come on it's time to collect okay you're taking Philly let's go all right I'll pick him up are you with her what's it look like all right, let's make it. Let's go, let's go. All right. That was a crazy one. 
But yeah, sorry about that cut, guys. I know it was like a little cut. There we go. Ooh, that was nice. Overkill. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. Damn. There's too many, man. Come on, come on. I'm trying to get the hell out of here. There's too many. All right. Alright, let's go. Let's move. That's the end of the canyon. And I think we might be free of them. Ride for it. I hope so. We made it out. I'm serious? Yep, and so am I. Hit him, John, please. Hey, you don't need to do that just because she told you to. I don't need to be hit. I just want to be treated civil. Shut it. You heard the lady. Exactly. I still protest my innocence. This woman ripped me out of my bed, kidnapped me, then let Langton kidnap me, then you killed them all and kidnapped me back. I'm the victim here. Damn you. John, would you be so kind as to shut him up? I got you. Don't listen to her. No, let me speak my piece. There's no call to hit me, mister. Listen to him squirm. Jesus. Bad dog. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. How did work ain't easy, John? No. I can see wards. That's a whole lot easier with a partner. That back there, you didn't need a partner. You needed a whole company behind you. Hmm. We did fine. And with Langton and his men gone, there'll be more demand for our service. <laughs> Sadie, you know I'm a rancher now. Mostly. And I know how you're paying for your ranch. Don't spread that around. Hey, I won't. But it would be good to have you along some more. Grab him and bring him in, John. Sure. You're a bitch and a bastard. We brought in Shane Finley. Here we go. Great. Let's uh, put him in the cell. Let's do it. We got him. You've unlocked turn and stop for your horse. Nice. I like that. Stamina's at level six. I object to this. Yeah, let's head to the cell. Drop you right in here, chump. Damn you! Just put him on the bed. We're gonna watch you swing. What for? I didn't do anything. Nothing. Yeah, yeah. I thought you said you lost him. Well, I did, but we got him back. Oh, and James Langton's dead. We killed him. Why'd you do a thing like that? It was him that robbed me. Okay. Here. There's a decent price on Finley. Mm-hmm. I know. <laughs> uh. You want this money to go to the bank, too? No, I'll, uh, I'll take it myself. <laughs> okay, Jim Milton. It's John Marston here. All right, well, if you need any more work, you can find me in town. Or maybe I'll find you. I'm retired. Sure. <laughs> Be well, John. That's a lot of money we got. That's 200 bones. 
Alright guys, I just want to thank you guys for watching. I will be trying to finish this up. Not trying, I will be finishing all this up for you guys uh, shortly. So you already know what it is, man. It's your boy, the original Game Head, and I'm off this. Peace.